Hi, I'm Steven Snyder. I'm one of the equipment designers here at Davron Technologies. I'm standing in front of DTI 1434. We wanted to give you a little bit of an overview of this oven as it's in progress. This oven will be finished up in about three months, but we wanted to give you a look as we're in the process of putting it together. This oven consists of three heated zones and is designed to cross-link an elastomeric foam product. When it's finished, it'll have three levels of conveyors that will traverse the product from the front to the back. Let me show you some of the components that are vital to the performance of this oven. Each zone consists of a central circulation fan and a central burner. The circulation fan is built into interior ducting that also uses the interior walls as part of the plenum system. From there, the air is piped down these ducts and into centrally located plenum systems that aren't currently installed. Each of the interior ducts has adjustable dampers to help regulate airflow during the process. These three oven sections will be joined end to end to form one long conveyor system. When they're joined, the things that you won't see as much is some of the internal framework that we use in these ovens. These are not typical tongue and groove wall ovens. All of our ovens have a complete structural framework that supports all of the interior as well as the exterior assemblies. In this oven section, you can see the plenum systems for each conveyor are already installed. On the top level, the airflow comes in top down into this oven and then returns through the free space back into the fan. This is for the top conveyor, the middle conveyor, and the lower conveyor. On this particular oven, the conveyor belt will be supported by stainless rods as it travels through and as it returns back through the oven system. By using solid stainless rods to support this conveyor belt, we're able to eliminate a lot of bearings and a lot of potential maintenance. In order to meet NFPA explosion relief guidelines, these ovens have three access doors down each side. The central access door, which isn't yet installed, will have three viewing windows that correspond to the different heights of the conveyors. Once this oven is complete, it will be thoroughly tested in-house at our facilities before it's disassembled, prepared for shipping, and shipped to our customer where it can be installed in their facilities.